Hello everyone, Melissa here. Welcome to your Melissa Moment. You guys, today we are talking about Il Maquillage. I'm saying it completely wrong, I'm aware. I don't know how to say it. It's makeup, it's foundation, don't ask me. Okay, I've already done a video, you probably saw it, on this specific foundation. Um, when I ordered it, I'm sure you've seen it, it's advertised everywhere. I don't remember where I saw it originally, Facebook, TikTok, I don't know, somewhere. Um, but I did their little test to see what color you are, and this is the one that they said I was. So if you watch my first video, I'll probably get my husband to link it in the description so you can check it out if you missed it. Um, but this is the color they said I was. Now, when I tried it on in that video, it didn't look horrible, but it also didn't look like a complete match to me either. Um, I wore it. I asked my friend, I'm like, does this foundation, does this match, does this look okay, does it look out of place? Tell me. And she goes, no, I think it's okay. Um, it just, it looks more like I have a bit of a tan with this one, I would say. So, I mean, we're just heading into summer. Who knows? Maybe with summer, this will be the perfect match for me once I get a little color on my face, right? Um, it's possible. But for every day, I'm like, it's just, it's just a shade or two off. So I went back and I did the test again. And I didn't think I answered the questions that differently. But it came with a completely different color like a lot lighter than this, like 10 shades lighter than this. So I'm like, weird. Now I will say, I'm very impressed with their customer service. Okay, their customer service is awesome. I emailed them and I said, hi, I just got this. I think the shade's a little off. Can I return it and get a different shade? They were amazing. They answered my email quickly. Um, and not only that, they told me that I could keep this one and they would send me a different shade at no cost. None. No cost, you guys. Amazing. So it's here. It's here. So we're going to try the new shade and see if it matches and also compare it to this shade and see how different it is. Okay, now with that said, I have another package too. Why you ask? Well, also for the trouble of sending a shade that doesn't match, because I said, hey, I used your quiz and it just doesn't work. They also gave me a, I think it was a $20 gift card to use in their store. Just for saying sorry. Yeah, so I went ahead and I think I ordered a blush because they actually have other makeup products too. It's not just foundation, they have other makeup products. So I was like, oh, maybe I need a new blush because I think I only have one blush. So I think that's what I ordered was a blush with my um, gift card. So that's in one of these too. So we're going to open both and we're going to look. Now before we do, I'm just going to bring up the color um, chart. Let me see. How do you pronounce it? Do you guys know Il Maquillage? Il Maquillage? Maquillage? Nobody knows. Um, okay. So let's see. Okay. I'm just going to look and see if, okay, so here's all the different shades. Like, they have a lot of shades. Come on, focus. Focus. They have a lot of different shades, you guys. Look at that. Look at that. Now, the first shade I got is 040. Okay, let me find it. Nope. Nope. There it is. 040. Focus. So this one here is the first one I got. So let's see which one of these is the foundation. I don't know. Let's open it and see. We're going to start with the foundation. 
If this happens to be the blush, I'm not going to show you yet. I'm just going to open the other one. This one's lighter, so I'm thinking this is the blush. Oh my god. Okay. Okay, that's the blush, of course. Let's go open the other one. So yeah, like I was saying, customer service excellence. Excellence. And they also have been regularly sending me um, coupons in my inbox. And I'm talking like good coupons, you guys. Like, again, like $20 off. Like, good stuff. Um, okay, so here it is, the foundation. So it comes in this cute little box. Here it is here. It's heavy. Um, okay, so again, they give you little instructions on how to apply it. Apply two pumps of foundation to the back of your hand or directly to your brush or sponge applicator. Using the brush or sponge applicator, dab the foundation onto your skin, blend the foundation over your entire face and below the jawline. Wait five minutes for it to completely set. It says don't compare the shade match to your neck or your wrist, they can be a different tone than your face, which is interesting because growing up in the 80s, I was always taught to blend it into your jawline. They're saying don't do that. Interesting. So the one they sent me, you guys, this is so different. This is 040. They sent me 010. That's a big difference, you guys. It starts on 005. This is the second shade. Wow. So that's one, two, three, four, five, six shades lighter than this. Like, I don't know, you guys. Is this one going to be too light? It's taped on the side here. Hang on. It's taped. Like, I'm nervous. But I did their quiz. But, I mean, I did it the first time, too, and it was wrong. I don't know, guys. Okay, so this is it. Zero ten. Now, it's hard to tell. They look very similar. And I think it's because the bottle is, um, I mean, I guess if you hold it this way, you can see the difference. So this is the original one they sent me, and it was a little too dark. Here's the new one. I think it's going to be too light. Zero ten. I don't know. Okay, we're going to try it. We're going to try it and see. I have my little pre-dampened sponge applicator. It's still got foundation on there from last time. But that's fine. We're just going to, we're going to try it. Okay. Let me put it on my hand first to show you on my hand. Okay, I'll do the first one. So let me just do a little bit. Come on. Okay. So this is the first color. And then let me do th this new one. Oh, I put too much of the new one. Okay. Hang on. Oh, you guys, I don't know. Okay, I put way too much of the new one, but this is the first color, and this is the new one. You guys, the new one looks way too light. Oh, my gosh. It looks way too light. Oh, you guys, this is going to be horrible. Okay, that's fine. Whatever. Let's just try it. Oh, it's going to be horrible, you guys. Okay, 010. I'm going to put it on the other side here. Hang on. Sorry, I just got a message from my neighbor. They want us to watch their, or he wants us to watch his cat. Okay. Okay, you guys. Okay, my God. Okay. You guys, it looks too light. Oh my God, really? <laughs> why? Why, why, why? Like, I swear I'm going to have to, like, blend the two together. 
it's so hard, you guys, getting foundation. Like, online. Because you can't, you know, test it. You can't see. Like I said, their customer service was amazing. But uh, I also don't want to be that person that's like, hey, this bottle doesn't work either. Like, they've already given me a new bottle. I don't know. It's hard to tell. I've got sun coming in here. Need more. I've got sun coming in here. It's hard to tell in the computer screen. Oh, you guys, I don't know. I don't know, you guys. And keep in mind, I'm not great with putting makeup on either. Blend, 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 blend. Blend into the jaw. Blend into the hairline. Blend, blend, blend. And the eyes around the nose. I don't know. Okay. It's on. How does it look? Does it look too light? I don't know. You tell me. What do you think? What do you think, guys? I mean, let me look at my other camera. I mean, you know what I should have done? I should have done one half of my face with the new one and one half with the old one. But, I mean, you guys, this might be okay. I think it looks okay. It looks okay, right? I think it does. Okay. Okay, zero, ten. It's made in Italy. Ooh, fancy. I mean, I look a little washed out, but I always look washed out. <laughs> mm. I gotta work tonight, so gotta do my face. Let's blend it into the jawline. I mean, are we... Okay, now it's just leave it five minutes to set. I mean, I'm not mad at it. I think it... Yeah. Okay. All right. I think it's okay. I think, okay. Because like I said, they have so many shades. Like this is 10. Because all the other ones, 15 is too dark. I can tell on here. 20 is too dark. 25 is too dark. 30 is too dark. 35 would have been the next one, I would say, which is a shade lighter than that. But I'm, I'm starting to think 10 is okay. Okay, you guys, this might be okay. It, I'm not going to lie. I think it's okay. Um, okay, well... We're going to, we're going to use 10 and, uh, you know, I mean, I'm going to check it in different lighting, but I mean, I've got natural light coming in here and I think, oh my God, don't look at my gray hair. Wow. That was okay. I think it's okay. I think it's okay. You guys, I think 10 will be okay. All right. Let's look into the next little package we have from them. Like I said, I think I got a blush here. It is here. Oh, no, I didn't get a blush. I got a loose powder. Oh, yay. I need loose powder because I'm out. Okay. Nice. I got loose powder. 
Now, let me look up their loose powder because first, let, let's see, let me go to So yeah, they've got they've got stuff for face, lips, eyes, skin. So they even have like um like moisturizers and serums and lip balms. Like you guys, they've got lots of stuff. They really do. They have foundation, concealer, blush and bronzer, highlighter, contour, powder, primer, setting spray. They even have brushes and tools. Then they have lip color, lip palette, lip liner, lip brushes, eyeshadow, eye palette, mascara, eyeliner, eyelashes, eyebrow, and eye brushes. Ooh, they have eyelashes and eyebrow. Now, one of my free gifts from them with my first foundation was a um, eyeliner, and I really like it, you guys. I really do. Let's see what they have for eyebrows. Ooh. They have like brow duos and brow pen and brow shapers, brow gel. You guys, they have so much stuff. That's so cool. Um, okay, let's just look into the powder real quick. Because I can't remember. I got loose powder. Okay, so they have loose powder. They have transparent loose powder. And then they also have pressed powders. I got loose powder. Um, it looks like they've got three shades of loose powder. They have got a, it's called butternut, which is a deep almond beige with warm undertones. So that would be for a little bit darker skin tones. They've got a matte natural light ivory with cool undertones and a nude beige, which is light beige with cool undertones. So matte natural, I think is what I got. Yes, matte natural. Um, I'm glad I got the loose powder. I forgot because I'm all out of loose powder. Perfect. Okay, so this is what it looks like. That's the color. I think that'll be perfect. I think that'll be perfect. Nice. Let's open it up and have a peek. There's a little bit of powder on the outside, so. Ooh. I've got the little protector there. We're going to open that up. Ooh. Oh, nice. I'm just going to, there's a little bit that came up on there. I'm just going to take this and a little bit of powder. And we're just going to press the powder in. And it's a matte, which is nice. I don't like looking shiny. I know shiny is kind of the way to look right now. Everyone's got highlighters and stuff, but it's just not my thing. Again, I don't do makeup often. I am definitely not a pro when it comes to makeup by any stretch of the imagination you guys I have no clue what I'm doing so if you see me doing something wrong I know feel free to give me tips or let me know if I'm doing something wrong but all I ask is you be kind because I've never claimed to know what I'm doing I've never claimed I mean, you guys, I kind of like it. I kind of like it. Now, here's the thing. I'm tempted now. I'm tempted to buy more things from them because, like, I'm, I'm pretty tempted. Um, like I said, they have a whole bunch of stuff. I might. So I think this shade's much better. I like the powder. Yeah, I'm sold on it. It's been good. Um, like I said, I have to work tonight and stuff. I'm going to wear this all day, see how it does. Last time I wore the darker shade, um, I don't remember there being any issues. It wore all day. 
it looked good all day. Um, I don't remember it like, you know, doing anything weird. There wasn't like any peeling or any dry spots or anything last time I wore the darker shade. So um, I'm going to assume that this is going to be just as good. So we'll see. I might order more stuff from them. I mean, you guys know I love Jeffree Star makeup, and that's typically what I've been using, but I do not like Jeffree Star's eyeliner or mascara. Um, and Jeffree doesn't have any blushes. So I might get a couple more things from them. We'll see. We'll see what happens. Uh, I might have some coupons still in my inbox that I'm going to look into as well. So anyway, that is it for this one. Um, thank you guys so much for watching this. Let me know in the comments, have you tried this? Uh, what are your thoughts on it? Are you on the fence and you've thought about it, but you're not sure? Let me know. I'd love to hear from you guys. And we'll see you guys in the next one. Bye.